The European Union Aviation Safety Agency has granted type certification to the Airbus A321 XLR, which is equipped with CFM Leap 1A engines. This certification will facilitate the aircraft's entry into service at the end of the summer. Isabel Bloy, the A321 XLR's chief engineer, received the type certificate from Florian Guillermet, the executive director of IESA. The Pratt & Whitney engine variant is expected to undergo certification later in 2024. Christian Scherer, CEO of Airbus Commercial Aircraft Division, emphasized the aircraft's distinctive attributes, such as its long-range and adaptable cabin, which facilitate the development of new direct routes and service opportunities for airlines. The A321 XLR is positioned as a unique product that provides efficacy by virtue of its commonality with the A320 and the A321 range. Airbus is currently concentrating on preparing the A321 XLR for its initial commercial missions, as certification has been successfully obtained. The company intends to collaborate closely with customers to facilitate the integration of this new aircraft into their inventories, highlighting its potential to broaden market opportunities for airlines and improve travel options for passengers. In an airline's fleet, the A321 XLR is positioned alongside wide bodies. It provides the ability to expand capacity, establish new routes, or maintain the operation of existing ones in the event of fluctuating demand. All of this can be achieved at approximately half the cost of modern wide bodies, and it consumes 30% less fuel per seat than previous generation competitor aircraft. The A321 XLR's upgraded airspace cabin will offer passengers long-haul comfort in all classes. The debut A321 XLR flight was successfully executed in June 2022. This was followed by a comprehensive test program that involved three demonstration aircraft. Thus far, more than 500 Airbus A321 XLRs have been ordered. Now, do you think Airbus 321 XLR will slow down sales of the wide bodies? Let us know in the comments. We bring you some good information on aerospace. Please like and share the video and subscribe the channel.